Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to disable the creation of SharePoint site for all users. You know, when you work in an enterprise environment or you work for a company and you want to disable, you want to make sure that users are not allowed to create SharePoint sites on their own, so you can actually disable it from the SharePoint Admin Center, which means that if anyone wants to create a SharePoint site, or a site, they will first of all need to contact the IT department or the person who is in charge or the SharePoint administrator to create a SharePoint site for them and then they can manage that site. So here, here's what you're gonna do. First of all, you will need to go to your, log on to your Microsoft Office 365, go to the homepage, click Admin Center, which will take you to the Admin Center. Please don't click on the SharePoint link here just click on the admin center and here you will go to your admin center and click on sharepoint because norm on the, normally when you when you log on to your admin center you must probably see this and just click on show all and here um on your ad admin center portal just click on sharepoint when you click on the sharepoint you take you to your sharepoint admin center so on your sharepoint admin center you click on settings on our settings, you have like the different options here. What you're actually interested on is the site creation. You see, set default settings for new site. So what I do is just click on the site creations. And here you see, let users create site from the SharePoint start page and OneDrive is enabled. So right now, every user in, the, in this company can will be able to create a SharePoint site. So what you just need to do is this. Disable this and then click save. So by saving this, which means users will not have the option to create a SharePoint site. So let's actually verify this because if we um, disable the creation of SharePoint site, which you can see it has been disabled, so users should not be able to create SharePoint site, but they, should, they can only be able to manage a SharePoint site. So what we here we have all the active sites, so we can decide to create um, a SharePoint site for a new request. So if I go to here, I'm logged in, uh, log on as Nora Johnson, who of course is not a member of uh, um, the admin group in um, in Office 365. So let's click on SharePoint. Here, as you can see, Nora does not have the option to create a new. Um, a new site, she only has the option to create a new post, but she will not be able to create a site. But if you created a site for Nora, then of course she's going to see the site and you give, and Nora becomes the, uh, the, the, the admin of that site. She's going to see that site uh, listed here on her site, but Nora will, should not be able to create a new site. So thank you very much for watching this video and I hope um, this video will be able to help you and assist you so that you don't need to search so long on how to disable the creation of um, SharePoint site. So please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you think this video has been of any help to you, please don't forget to leave a comment or give me a thumb or a like. And also if you have any question concerning um, um, IT, concerning uh, Office 365, you can as well send me an, um, an email or leave a comment and I will respond as quick as possible. Thank you very much and see you next time.